Hey, what's happening, everybody? Special request video. Somebody wanted me to make a video talking about the most important settings or what I think are the most important settings on the Google Pixel 8. Now, the first thing that I want to talk about is your at a glance widget. This is the first thing. And look, I'm, and my Pixel is all set up already, so it's been a while. But whenever I do get a Pixel or say you get a Pixel, I highly recommend you set up your at a glance widget to do whatever it's, it's going to do. So you come over here with the settings. You see all this stuff right here. All right, we come over here and you can see my at a glance. I use it for everything. You can see what's going on here. So I got it set up to show everything. So very, very helpful. I think it's awesome. The only thing I wish, and I'll show you all something here. I wish at a glance looked more like that. On the, you know, I wish you could set it up to look like that versus being stuck with that right there. I mean, it's not horrible, but at the same time, I prefer I prefer this right here. I prefer that look right there. So you all know. To me, it's just it's more usable. It's easier to hit the weather easier to hit the calendar because over here whenever i go like to hit the weather it'll, it'll open the calendar sometimes or or vice versa so anyway enough of that so the next most important setting on your google pixel 8 that i think is the most important uh, for me anyway is i come over here and i come down to display and i definitely definitely i adjust my display settings this is the most important part of the phone or at least it's the part of the phone that you interact with the most. So I turn off adaptive brightness. I'm not into that. I leave my brightness set at one thing. And, you know, at night, like, but at night when I, you know, if I am in a dark room or somewhere, you know, I will turn the brightness down. But anyway, a uh, very important thing here for you all to know. I recommend that you all set your screen time out for 15 or 30 seconds. The only reason mine's at 10 is I make these videos. All right, next up, very important, dark theme, of course. Uh, I wanted to show you all something, though. Colors, come over here and you can set your uh, your colors. So you can either pick natural or adaptive. I'm all about, you know, adaptive. I prefer that look better. I prefer that look, I prefer that look right there versus this, look. I, yeah, I prefer this. I love the punchy look and the pop and all that. Let me come over here. I keep thinking it's on a slide over. <laughs> all right, and anyway, yeah, so there you go there. So that's that right there. Next up, you got your battery over here, adaptive charging. And it's really important to like, you know, understand like the most crucial settings of your phone. Like what I'm showing you here, what I think is the most crucial without making a video that goes on like forever. So your display, your battery, you know, your home screen, things like that. Now, as far as uh, developer options, I only recommend that you mess with your developer options only if you know what you're doing and look i made a video one time teaching people how to access their developer options and everyone got all mad at me because it claimed they claimed they did something wrong so if you know how to do it do it but the only reason i use my developer options is i'll turn down my transition animations down to 0. 0.5 versus one i know some people like zero animations i i do 0. 0.5 because i like a little bit of animations but all right that's gonna be it for this video and i will catch all of you in the next one take care